Hey, what's up guys? So here I am in, uh, in the rainforests of Malaysia. No, just kidding. Actually, it's, uh, it's like a, a guided tour uh, to this island. And I kind of took it on myself to go off the beaten track a little bit uh, into the jungle and to see what's out there on the island, right? So uh, I was very lucky. I found a very secluded, beautiful beach. Look at this. It's not a big beach, but I'm pretty much the only one here. No, uh, no other people, no tourists. That's quite nice. Wow, look at this. This is amazing. This is what you really want to see when you go to, uh, to Malaysia. And like right now, about 10 minutes on the other side, it's like literally like hundreds of Korean and Chinese tourists here for the spring festival holidays. And I'm here by myself. Actually, right now when I was walking here, I saw this huge lizard. Like, I'm not kidding you, about one meter long. Like walking down from the jungle into the, to the ocean. I will just put up the video later. That was, that was pretty cool. It's raining a little bit. Uh, I will try the water, see how it's like. Might go for a, a quick swim. All right, catch you later. Okay, just went into the water right now. Um, I don't have too much time, so I'm not going for a swim. Just wanna show you guys this. This is like civilization, right? On these islands, a lot of plastic bottles everywhere. And because it's a little bit off the beaten track, nobody cleans up. Really sad, yeah? And I realized it was a bit of a mistake to, um, to go to the water because now my my slippers, which are really meant for a nice, uh, yeah, group tour on a boat, are not really good for walking in the jungle. But anyway, we keep on going and see what's out here. Wow, look at these holes. These are huge. I really wonder what made these holes. Several of them here, yeah? Could be, oh, four. Could be some kind of like uh, nests for these lizards. <laughs> I don't know off the beaten track right now feel a bit like uh, like crocodile dundee here <laughs> it's nice it's I, I love i love the jungle you know, especially like living in china like you're you're so far away from the the nature well wow, look at this look at this you see those spikes on, on this tree here i guess this means this tree was in the uh, in the ocean for we're growing in the ocean for some time they look a bit like some kind of seaweed or something i'm not sure anyway they're sharp and i'm wearing flip flop flip flops slippery flip flops <laughs> all right i think i see something here at the end of the uh the walkway could be the ocean again yes i'm hoping for a beautiful secluded beach let's see what they have Wow, look at this. I think I see something here. This looks really nice. Wow. This is the wide open ocean here. Yeah, this, this is what I mean. This is what I was looking for. This is it. Okay, maybe I was hoping for like a nice sandy beach. Not, not stony beach. But anyway, this is beautiful. This is really gorgeous. And I mean, the color of the water is just amazing. Now, I can't really go much further down the beach because I am wearing my flip-flops and they're not really made for these, uh, these slippery rocks right here. But amazing, yeah? I just saw a, a staircase into the jungle going on my right. So I'm gonna try that and see what, what happens. See what that is. It's right here. See that? I'm not sure if you see it, but anyway, I'm gonna go up it right now. It looks a bit like it's uh, actually not, not even man-made. It's like these, these roots, these roots with sand going all the way up here. I'm gonna try a little bit. I don't have too much time. I have to be back by the boat in around 
in around 30 minutes or 40 minutes more or less. And it is slippery, it is rainy, so I might just call it a day. And I guess this goes all the way up to the mountain up here. Well, okay. I'm gonna go back down now. <laughs> I found this on the way between the, the tourist group and, and where I was right now. It's basically what they call the, the longest uh, line, uh, like, like a hanging line between two islands. Um, once again, it's like really amazing uh, view here. Just look at this. incredible so guys I told you there seems to be quite a few of these uh, big lizards here I'm sure if you can see it in the jungle but it's, it's really huge looks like uh, a small crocodile almost I mean, look at that beautiful uh, coloring. It's a bit like uh, yellow, black. Okay, now I'm coming too close, he's getting a bit shy. But uh, look at that tongue. It's like two decimeters long. Like right now I saw him like uh, eating a, a chicken bone or something. I think he can hear me talking actually. He's like reacting to my talk. Hey buddy, how are you? Enjoying lunch? All right, I'm gonna leave you alone now. Just, just incredible. I mean, they live here with people. I mean, there's like houses here and it's like tourists. Not right here, but like on the other side of the island. And these guys are still living here. It's incredible. It's a bit like going back in time, you know, like you feel like you're seeing a, like a dinosaur or something. It's the first time I, I ever see these. Like I never saw one in, in a zoo as well. They're huge. I'm guessing one one meter point two, roughly. Look at those look at those feet. Look at those claws, man. Wow. This is incredible. Okay, I would say it's very nice here, despite all these uh, people. It's the water. I mean, look at this watercolor. Just like esmeralda, blue, light color. It's just so beautiful and uh, enticing. You know, I would just like love to jump in right now. If there were less people here. <laughs> um, actually, this piece is okay. This side is okay. And here we have my, my lovely wife and my lovely daughter. Yeah. 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 Yeah.